West Brom. Hoping early nerves will settle, but it won't do their nerves any good to be defending this. It's Danny Granville, and it's well struck and deflected, and that's a very good save by Russell Holt. He shouldn't have got the shot in. It's as simple as that. I mean, Granville's standing. They can all see it, and they're a little late getting to him. And that deflection was taken around to the top corner off. No, great save by Holt, but was really well struck by Granville. But once this happens, and who knows, that's a good tip over. The PFA's first division goalkeeper of the year. Good spot by the referee. West Brom have the free kick. Eddie Wilson home, one of the select group of referees. Darren Moore is forward, he's only scored once for West Brom, that's below par by his scoring standards. This is Darren Moore though, and there's Johnson now, was he pushed, it's Moore, it's in! Darren Moore for West Brom! And what were we saying, he's not scored his fair share. Well, how much is that one worth? Well, it's worked out perfectly for him because he's the one that's got to the far post to win the initial header and get it back across goal. I thought there was a foul by Rialati on Johnson. He seemed to push him out of it. Does it matter? Does it help? Having got the earlier header in, Moore has just held his ground. The ball's arrived straight back at his feet. And to be honest, once it comes back to him, centre-back it doesn't get many goals or not. He can hardly miss that. And this place has gone absolutely wild. What a goal that is. Through Kalinko's legs, maybe, in the end. Anyway, we'll do. There's Chambers. He was fouled by Mullins. It's going to be the first yellow card of the game. He had been warned. He was victim of one earlier himself, and he can't really excuse that. He's very late on Chambers. So a chance for West Brom. They're not content to qualify for the Premiership by dint of Wolves losing, they want to win handsomely. And Neil Clements' prize with his left foot has been a feature of the season. It is Clements, and it's awkward, it's Taylor! It's 2-0! Oh, it's within touching distance now! And the goal has been scored! by one of West Brom's greatest ever strikers. He can see the promised land. I always make a case for a goalkeeper when the ball bounces in front, and it wasn't the most wickedly struck shot in the but I'm sorry, on this occasion, I just can't defend Kalinko. It's a dreadful error by the goalkeeper. But Bob Taylor was put in the side today specifically for sniffing out chances like that. He did something similar after a Clement free kick and getting the winner at Nottingham Forest recently. He's done it again today, but it's a dreadful goalkeeping mistake. One becomes two. Nationwide is about to become Premier. Never mind three lines on the shirt. For Frank Skinner, it's all about his beloved baggies now. Very shortly, it'll be journey's end for West Bromwich Albion. One of the most historic, one of the most famous, one of the proudest names in English football. Stewards all the way round the perimeter of the pitch, but they're going to have a job on to stop the invasion. And the referee has decided to blow up early. And West Bromwich Albion are in the Premiership.